Today let's talk about why you might want to use a camera with your 3D printer. I will introduce two types of cameras that I'm going to use as examples. Then I will show you how to use them with Octopi. Before we start, make sure you guys hit the like button and subscribed. So first, let's talk about the two reasons why you would want to use a camera. Either you use it for monitoring so that you can monitor your printer remotely, or you gonna do time-lapse videos or just record the actual print. These two cameras are all good for monitoring and time-lapse. Octoprint has the capability of setting up all your time-lapses, and they can directly connect to Raspberry Pi. I'll put the links to these cameras in the description below. This 5 megapixels autofocus camera is fairly cheap, only $19.99 and incredibly easy to set up. Look at this 1 meter extension cable, it's long enough for mounting the camera, especially useful when you don't want to place the camera near the Raspberry Pi. If you need a higher resolution autofocus camera, you can find 8 megapixels and 12 megapixels autofocus cameras from Argicom. Alright. Now let's switch over to 12 megapixels high quality PTZ camera. It's capable of remote directional and zoom control. That means a single camera can be used to monitor places that should be covered by multiple ones. And this kit is based on the IR cut switchable camera to get sharp imaging all day and night. If you don't need such a high resolution PTZ camera, you can choose the 5 megapixels version or 8 megapixels version. The usage is the same. Alright, let me show you how to use the camera with OctoPi. Before you start, don't forget to install OctoPi. If you don't know how to install it, you can refer to this page or watch this great video guide. Okay, first, make sure the camera can be detected. Then enable I2C interface. Install the SM bus. Now you need to install the Argicom plugin. Open up the Octopi login page. Ok, now we are successfully logged in. You can click the buttons to control the camera and printer. Alright, that's all. See you guys in my next video. Have a great day and bye.